Here we go. Top sent us a nice box of high heritage. So let's take a peek inside. There's the big card. 24 packs. base cards looking like I think it's 1967 and I'll get through and put the no purchase necessary stuff on here I'll also put the stated odds in the back of the pack and I'll have to dig through look at the numbers on the back see the short prints and also always I think there's the variations Rookie performers. A lot of people like this stuff. Queen Kings. some dual and triple autos in here. Now and then. Also had the tops here this minor league to open up after this. Rookie AJ Reed. I think this tradition, there we go, award winner Mike Trout. They started with the 1952 year back in what, 2001 or something like that. So this product's had a long shelf life. And what do we have now and then again? Japan, the Chiro. Dodger duo Peterson and Gonzalez. There we go. Looks like a refractor, maybe. Austin Jackson, number to five eighty five sixty seven. More base. Some of those rare parallels of those sell pretty well. And there's our Adrian Gonzalez clubhouse collection. The tears that won't fetch a whole lot. Those 
on the back. And more base. I'd rather take an autograph and a relic any day. But... Have used to been pretty good on this stuff. There's a rookie performer, Tyler Lagman. There's another one, Edwin Diaz. This is must be a rookie. Yeah, number the 24 packs. Bean Town Belters. Bomber. Links for Jim for Detroit. And then we had the high number baseball box topper, three cards in one. Not sure if anything special can come out of these. Michael Farmer, Pagan, and Wilson Contreras for the Cubs. No numbering or dates or stats on the back. So that's it for 2000 Top Heritage 16 high number. So thanks, Top, for sending that. And I'm going to get ready to open up the minor league, which I think is pretty much a one hit relic or auto. So thanks for watching and check out Sports Card Forum for anything related to sports cards.